Hey guys, let's, we're gonna do end of the year messages for whatever sign this is. Let's see what comes out. Let's see you guys, what sign is this for? For you guys with the highest white light. Yes, this is the highest white light. What sign is this for? I'm gonna put these back because they're just you know, crazy. No funny shit, I'm getting a Pisces, but let's see. In the prices so that's what I've seen and then all this shit came out and it says black magic and that's a raven just flipped over in the other day let's see what sign is this for somebody don't want their shit to be exposed over here they don't want their shit to be exposed I'm gonna do Pisces okay this is the card I keep saying alright so tell me meditate and contemplate Pisces don't let your past hold you back. Self know. So there's a Pisces here living in the self know that there's an end of a tough cycle that is approaching. Full moon and um, Capricorn. Show the world the real you. Full moon in Aquarius. So there's an ending coming here for somebody that's living in their self know or something that is a part of your self know. Okay. Um, something here is about to get exposed. That's what I'm getting here. And this would be about a father figure is an ending here with a father figure or baby daddy the end of a tough cycle approaches show the world the real you somebody needs to live in their purpose and live in their truth okay nothing will come of this situation without living in your truth period all right let's see messages for pisces dealing with a sun goddess and a Lilith. Hmm. So this is two different energies to me. Yeah, evil eye. Okay. So somebody's giving this um, sun goddess the evil eye. This could be you or Pisces. This could be somebody else. Cryptocurrency. Look, Pisces. Cryptocurrency, Pisces. We got cancer and foreign. So somebody could drive a foreign car. They could be into cryptocurrency, Bitcoin, trading whatever it is or stocks cancer this could be a um overly emotional mother figure that's what i'm getting that drives a foreign vehicle but they're giving this sun goddess uh evil eye or this sun goddess drives a foreign vehicle and that's why they're giving them the evil eye take what resonates all right karmic this person is karmic and they are trapping somebody with a baby trap baby okay full moon something about the full moon check your car okay car check something about somebody's car somebody's somebody's evil eyeing somebody's car or they did something to somebody's car That's what I'm virgo so somebody is doing something to your car this could be your baby mama 666 they're mad because this sun goddess is gifted with many gifts or you're marked with many gifts okay the hermit so this virgo here a warning for somebody all right one more message for this one. One more all right lucifer you are not the daddy in aries so this is a spiritual attack okay the devil is trying to get you virgo or pisces i'm getting that thing about somebody trying to swap energies with you your opposite signs might trying to swap energies with you they're trying to take your gifts you're very gifted this person's trying to take your gifts this could be your baby mama or this could be your baby daddy you're not the father of this child for somebody they're not the father yep you hear that car beep confirmation this person is not your soulmate evil eye they're giving you the evil eye. They're jealous of you. Scorpion. Ancestors. Charmed. So somebody is very gifted. And they, um, they're, they are a part of a very powerful group of witches. Very powerful group. Or they come from a, 
a very powerful bloodline. That's what they come from, a very powerful bloodline of witches and they're, they're, um, they have a, a, a prophecy that they have to fulfill. Gemini, twins, they are a twin flame. They are a twin flame and they have a purpose to fulfill. So you could be a twin flame and somebody's giving you the evil eye or they're giving your person the evil eye because they're mad because you have a person and this person is trying to be that person. They're trying to be that person and they're trying to fuck up every chance that you get to be with this person and they even trapped you with a baby that is not yours. Okay? Pisces, this could be you. This is from a whole nother deck. This is about a child. Somebody did work to get this child, okay? That's not even yours. Or something like that. Let's see. What messages do we have for Pisces spirit? This is Somebody's trying to get you in some sort of car accident where they're trying to do something to your car. You could have got a new car. They're trying to do something to it. And they could have did something to your old car. Now you have to get a new one. I don't know. Jesus. You are a prophet. Chief Keep. Somebody could love Chief Keep, their favorite artist, or they could smoke a lot of weed. Um, you have kids. Your kids are being protected at this time and you need to protect yourself while you're traveling, okay? Because somebody is trying to get you into some sort of accident and the travel room came out three times. So be careful when you're traveling. Don't be speeding this shit. I suggest take an Uber. Cinderella, so you have a person that you want to crown and somebody is trying to basically put on their slipper. Psychic attack that you're being protected from, 444, this evil witch. You're being protected from this evil witch that opened up a portal, Jumanji. They're playing a fucking serious game that they can't win, okay? Angel baby, you have an angel baby on the way or in your energy that wants to be born. Or you can have a baby already and this baby is an angel, Michelle and Keisha. I'm getting like um, somebody's mother and somebody's um, somebody's mother is working with a baby mama to keep you in this um, to keep you trapped with this baby from going towards your person. They're working with this baby mama. Your mother is working with this baby mama, or the, the yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Secrets is being exposed about this bitch. Shit. They're probably being exposed right now. Evil stepmother. Like I said, black magic. That's so raven. Do we even need any more fucking cards? Pisces, I feel like this is your energy for some reason. What messages do Pisces need to hear? What messages do Pisces need to hear? The highest, most divine message for Pisces? What messages do they need to hear? Death. I am learning that endings are merely beginnings. Okay, so somebody could be um, a Scorpio or dealing with a Scorpio. Um, there is an ending coming here for somebody. Um, for a few of you guys, somebody calls an ending or a death. Somebody could have caused a death to someone. Maybe the balls of death or someone. Um, and they feel guilty about this. They, I release any beliefs that no longer assist my soul's growth. So somebody feels guilty? They have some sort of... Okay, empathy. I'm open to seeing both sides of the situation. So somebody feels guilty about this death or an ending. They feel guilty about ending something. Or they could have... Somebody's feeling really empathetic. They feeling guilty. I feel it. I feel like really sad. I feel like really sad right now. Grief. Somebody's grieving from somebody's death and they feel guilty about it. Grief. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. So this could be either this happened or someone could be getting ready to lose someone. And they're gonna go through grief because they're an empath. Um, somebody found something funny and it wasn't funny. Somebody did something. I choose to focus on the lighter side of life. Somebody, 
something isn't funny. Somebody found something funny and it wasn't funny. Like, or somebody is unable to use their sense of humor because they're an empathic of failure. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. So somebody made a mistake here. They were maybe they were laughing too much or or, or being too much in this energy in this um it's like playful energy. Like they were taking something as a joke when something was really serious and they made a mistake understand like if you did make a mistake own up to it and um this is an opportunity to learn from this okay Pisces you have you know everyone has the opportunity to change like if you made a mistake you know even if you if you did you know hurt someone um you know and you do have to serve time and something like that or um get some sort of karma from the universe just you know accept the fact that you need to get that but Put out good karma okay because this is only for your soul's growth this is only for you to grow i want to expand my consciousness and my awareness so this is only for you to grow okay um you're, you're you, you've been put in this um situation or you 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 cause a situation because of something about your self-esteem i possess the gifts of the soul that benefit me and others so you need adversity I accept challenges that are the best way to learn so you've been going through some sort of adversity but this is basically to to help you grow you could be um having challenges with your self-esteem or like some sort of like um like i said you could be jealous of someone you could have been really really jealous of someone um you could have been you know maybe you thought you weren't beautiful or you weren't good enough um you need to work on that okay you need to work on your self-esteem because you are beautiful and you are good enough but if you are you know having it out for people then you know you need to work on that that's something that you need to work on it's like a personal that is a personal adversity to you i feel like this is an adversity that you don't love yourself yeah 12 yeah 12 12 12 10 um love it's in reverse I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. So you weren't doing this in your relationships. You weren't basing your relationships out of love. This would be your relationship with yourself. Like, you know, or with people. I don't know. Freedom. I possess the power to free and the free will to create my own happiness. So you need to create your own happiness and stop living out of fear. I realize that I'm testing my resolve to live in the energy of love. So you need to start living in the energy of love and not lack. That's what I heard. Love and not lack. You're not lacking anything, you know? It's because you didn't get the person that you wanted or you don't get to stay in the same situation that you wanted to be in. You have to grow from this, you know? You can't just make people do things that they don't want to do or you can't just um, not take accountability for things when you did wrong, honesty. I can't always accept the truth from others, but I can accept it from myself. So you need to be honest about something. Or you need to be, yeah, you need to be honest about something. It's going to be with other people or yourself. Ooh. Okay. Worry. I'm learning that worry doesn't change the outcome. Yeah, somebody's worried about something. Somebody's worried about something. What's the humor? Ooh. They're hiding something that they did. I feel like somebody wants to confess judgment because they're receiving judgment i understand that everyone has their own unique paths and challenges they're receiving judgment about something that they did or they're about to abundance is in reverse so somebody is lacking now because of something that they did to somebody yeah all right with your self-esteem or um if you feel you did something and you want to own up to that you know if you want to make it better you need to own up to it and you need to you need to ask your spirit guides what is it that you want to do and if you don't have a good connection with your spirit guides you need to get someone that has a good connection with their spirit guides get advice from them you know um get some counseling because i feel like somebody's gonna need some deep counseling for this situation because somebody could be dealing with a lot of grief from losing someone and they could be acting out or they were acting out and they lost someone because of this or they did something to someone because of this okay i love you guys